Diseases of salivary glands its causes sign and symptom diagnosis treatment prevention and control. Let's break it down. Causes 1. Infections, viral, e.g., mumps, or bacterial, e.g., Staphylococcus aureus. 2. Obstruction, salivary stones, coelolithiasis, or tumors. 3. Autoimmune disorders, Sjogren's syndrome. 4. Trauma, injury to the salivary glands. 5. Tumors, benign, e.g., pleomorphic adenoma, or malignant, e.g., mucoepidermoid carcinoma. Signs and symptoms. 1. Pain and swelling, in the affected gland, parotid, submandibular, or sublingual. 2. Dry mouth, xerostomia reduced saliva production. 3. Difficulty swallowing, due to reduced saliva or obstruction. 4. Fever, in cases of infection. 5. Pus or discharge, from the gland or duct. Diagnosis. 1. Physical examination, palpation of the glands and ducts. 2. Imaging, X-rays, CT scans, MRI, or ultrasound. 3. Biopsy, fine needle aspiration or surgical biopsy. 4. Seeography. Imaging of the salivary glands and ducts using contrast dye. Treatment. 1. Antibiotics, for bacterial infections. 2. Pain management, analgesics and anti-inflammatory medications. 3. Surgery, to remove salivary stones, tumors, or affected glands. 4. Radiation therapy, for malignant tumors. 5. Salivary gland stimulation, medications or devices to increase saliva production. Prevention and control. 1. Good oral hygiene, regular brushing, flossing, and dental checkups. 2. Stay hydrated, to maintain saliva production. 3. Avoid sugary and acidic foods, to reduce risk of tooth decay and erosion. 4. Manage underlying conditions, such as Sjogren's syndrome or diabetes. 5. Regular medical checkups, to monitor for potential issues. Would you like more information on any specific aspect?